Some say it has enough seating for 48,500 spectators. Some even say that it looks like a sunflower. I say it's the North Mandela Bay Stadium. This World Cup stadium has passed the test. It has successfully hosted a game between Bafana Bafana and Japan in November 2009 and has changed the skyline of PE forever. Meet Dominic Vanessa, the lead architect behind this bold new stadium. The concept of the sunflower, the roof itself, consists of two elements, the petals of a flower, soft elements of the fabric. The fabric we use is called the PTFE. It is treated with a special glass fiber material and it's self-cleaning. In terms of the sunflower itself, um, we are a region noted for our, our beautiful vegetation, the garden root. Hence the, the, the flower, the, the sunflower aspect was something that it was natural for us to look at and to take up as a concept. I'll discuss the seating we had um, imported from China. It's a special blow mold seat. You won't see that anywhere in Africa. It gives you more comfort. Second aspect, we've chosen four various reds. So immediately when you look at the stadium and the seats are all the same, you can pick out by eye which are all the new seats. The stadium looks busy and you can't actually pick up any new seats that we've replaced. The first FIFA World Cup match to be held at this stadium will be between South Korea and Greece on the 12th of June 2010. This stadium will also host the third and fourth place finals on the 10th of July 2010. Beautycasters will bring you all the football magic off the pitch and I'll make sure you won't miss a thing.